perhaps no other bird has sparked as much debate among North American birders as the ivory-billed woodpecker. Others, however, adamantly believe a handful of the large, red-crested birds could still be out there, living in remote patches of the South only to occasionally reveal themselves in blurry videos, pixelated images, and ambiguous audio recordings of their distinctive Kent calls and double knock tap. As of today, the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service FWS, has made its position known, the agency has proposed officially removing the ivory-billed woodpecker from the endangered species list and declaring the iconic woodpecker extinct. The Lord God bird is among 23 species being proposed for removal. Of them, 11 are birds, including the Batchman's Warbler, a tiny, drab inhabitant of southeastern forests last spotted in 1988, and the bridled white eye, a small, olive, warbler-like bird once found on Guam. Hawaii alone is set to see eight avian species delisted, the Kauai Akiawoa, Kauai Nukupu, Kaiooo, Large Kauai Thrush, Maui Akepa, Maui Nukupu U, Malakai Creeper and Puyulai, habitat removal, introduced species like rats, climate change, and avian malaria have all wreaked havoc on the island's bird populations. These species extinctions highlight the importance of the ESA and efforts to conserve species before declines become irreversible, the agency said in the ANU, but before any of the species permanently lose their endangered status. The proposed rule will first be submitted to the Federal Register on September 29, from there, a public comment period will take place through November 29, after which a final decision will be made. Of all the species listed in today's announcement, the ivory build is sure to make the biggest waves throughout the ornithological world. Though the noose isn't a total shock. As the FWS notice details, the last generally agreed-upon confirmed sighting of the ivory-billed woodpecker was in 1944 on the Singer Tract in northeast Louisiana.